We all know the feeling. One minute you're sitting down, and the next you're squirming in torment as the sensation of pins and needles races up and down your leg. You might want to blame your uncomfortable situation on not enough blood reaching the leg, but in truth, it's your nerves doing the dirty work. Here's what's actually happening. Nerves send electrical signals to the brain that travel like water through a hose. When the hose is running normally, the brain processes the signals that give us the sense of touch. For example, soft, bumpy, and spiky. But sometimes we put pressure on nerves in a certain part of the body. That pressure can squeeze the pathway between the nerves and the brain shut. As a result, the limb goes numb. For example, when our legs are crossed and one falls asleep, it's usually because we've pinched the fibular nerve. But we don't start feeling pins and needles until after we've relieved the pressure and reopened the pathway. The nerves start to signal the brain again, but like a hose that sputters when you first turn it on, they take a few minutes to fire correctly. It's during those few minutes that we feel the tingles while the brain tries to process what's going on. While the tingles can be painful, they are normally completely harmless to your health. It's only if you leave the brain-body connection severed for several hours at a time that you could suffer from nerve damage.